Alright people, we got new decoys for goose season! And that's what we're gonna be talking about, huh doggies? Yeah! yeah. Alright guys, this is what you get with the kit. Your 12 socks, 12 sock supports, 12 snap grommets, your heads, they've got some uh, uprights, and then some like feeders, and then the uh, stance. And I'm going to show you how I put them together. Okay, so this is the order I go. So I put the first side of the sock on. I then put the sock support, which you can see there, which is that little spring thing. I then slip on the head, and this is all down lower on the pole here. Um, slip down on the head, and then I put that slip grommet right there, and then put the last side of the sock on. And then I slip it all the way up the tube to the top. And pretty much, the reason I like to put the snap grommet here is because I can extend this down a little bit and open the sock a little more if there's if it's kind of a low wind day if that makes sense the head's not going anywhere it's nice and stiff it's nice and support so it's all good all right boys and girls there's the tangle free new sock with 2d head all set up look at this look at this beautiful spread we got up we got Vinny. we got ben all right this is what we're doing goose hunting you guys know we came here yesterday, got a few shots off, but we're trying something different here. So let's see if it pays off. Let's do it. Oh, looking good. Feeder head, upright head. Oh yeah, sexy. Okay guys, so as you guys saw, we set up the uh, Tangle Free uh, decoy socks with the 2D heads and everything. We actually went goose hunting and stuff. And they brought some geese in. The goose hunting we're doing here, we're just pretty much getting flybys that are going from field to ponds, you know, whatever. We're pretty much just getting them between their little daily migrations. And so we send out all these socks and stuff to try to suck in a, a flock. Usually they're not really looking to land, but they'll fly over us. They're interested, they're investigative. So that's why we have like the socks and that's why I really like it because the socks give out that 3D, they give out that motion and stuff like that. I wanted to get some of the new skinnies too from Tangle Free, which I, I will get and we will try. Um, but a mix of those skinnies and then the socks and stuff is a perfect uh, goose spread um, that will you know get geese into you um, so you can get some kills on them. But uh, Honestly, really big uh, thank out to Tangle Free this year. This is the first waterfowl season that they're going to be sponsoring the youth group and everything. So we're going to have a lot more products for them. Uh, they're going to be sponsoring all of our waterfowl videos for the rest of the year. So you guys are going to see a lot of their products and stuff like that. Stay tuned for more stuff. Um, I hope you guys like this real quick unboxing kind of review and stuff. I am really impressed with them. The details great on them. They are like kind of felt um, and then painted on the white and stuff. The eyes are kind of thick. I mean, the little details, they honestly do come into effect. When you see that spread all out and, you know, like I've made homemade silhouettes and stuff like that. I mean, it just looks way better. And if it looks better to you, it's looking better to the birds too. You know, if, you, if you've if you got the money, especially like me, I'm trying to really get professional getting the guiding and stuff. So I'm really putting the money into the gear. If you guys are putting the money into the gear, uh, you know, it is going to help you in a sense once you have the basics down. Okay, so now you got the basics down, you're getting birds killed, but you wanna up those numbers, right? You wanna be more consistent, etc. That's when having a little bit higher quality gear is gonna come into play. Also, when birds are skittish and stuff, people aren't killing a lot. If you've got a little bit higher quality gear, that's paying attention to the details. You know, you got your jerk lines, stuff like that. You're really getting out there, figuring out what these birds are wanting, geese, ducks, etc. Um, and you got the gear to really accompany those skills, I mean, you're going to be deadly. So, like I said, stay tuned for more. You're going to see a lot of tangle free, and you're going to see a lot of ducks getting killed over these things. So, let's do it. Mm -hmm. 